This is my uh, my first time ever having a, a handmade bespoke suit on Savile Row, so come check it out. So here's the story. Pretty much for the last, I don't know, since I guess I was 20, it must be 21, 22, I've been coming past this shop, <clears throat> looking in the window, always, oh, look at all that. Always wanted to get myself a suit, and finally, uh, you know, 20 years later, I'm gonna have my first bespoke English made. The first on the street, the oldest tailor, kings and queens and exactly. emperors. So we felt it appropriate. We're gonna do, uh, we're gonna do the Aquaman suit, and because my boy Daniel here is this, uh, he's gonna help me out. We have the Dune premiere, and for sure, it's gonna be very quick fitting. So I'm excited. This will be my like first real thing. So let's do it. We've got various kind of things that we can be looking at. Yeah. So depending on kind of the route you want it to go down, whether you want it to keep it quite classic or whether yeah. you want it to go a little bit funky. Yeah, um, I think it's important to have both. Okay. Keep it classy and go funky. We have well, one of each. I wanted to do a. I've always wanted to do a uh, seersucker, but in black. So black on black seersucker. Yeah. Ooh. That's a couple things. Um, this is everything to me. That color right there. What, what color is that? What, what's the name of that color? Burgundy. Burgundy claret. Claret as well. That's my. That's my favorite color in the world. It's beautiful. That's my favorite. The black on black. Black on black, uh, Sears um, Sucker. Sucker. But I've always wanted a midnight blue, like the midnight yeah, the blue, like classic, classic, classic like. Yeah. But then when we get into the the, the double red, the white, I've always wanted to do white pants. This is for like Aquaman stuff, but I always wanted to do that white, double breasted, look like a gentleman. Everything that's in your front ear. Yeah. Everything that I'm not supposed to look like. So that's what you want to make actually, me look like. Actually, you might look like this. I was planning on building a suit for Dune. I asked uh, Daniel if we could build a suit, and that's four or five weeks away for the premiere. I couldn't make it to Venice, but I can't make it to the England one, so we're gonna have the premiere for Dune here. So we're gonna make a suit, and then I got called yesterday we would be able to go to, um, to 007, which is like an honor from Daniel. So we got two weeks to crunch it, and we're gonna make a suit, and then just to be able to be with the, the oldest, one of the greatest tailors in the world, and to be able to be styled this way, it'll, it's just an honor, so I'm pretty excited too. This will be the first fitting, so I'm like getting fitted for superhero suits, so proper bespoke. So it's normally a single breasted, uh, one button front. Yep. Uh, with a peak lapel, which is like the, your jacket. Is yeah, I was going to say it's kind of mine. Yeah. I like that, nice. For Dune, well, first off, we're gonna make this a beautiful three-piece black tuxedo, uh, three-piece for Bond, yep. right? Yeah. And the high-waisted pants with the vest, and then we're gonna take the, and this is all completely what they would do for Bond, except I'm gonna wear it. And um, 007 and triple six, we're, we're, we're all gonna meet <laughs> up for the party. And so I'm gonna wear the black, and then they'll have a beautiful red in interior, right? Yes. You can do black the red, burgundy. The black burgundy. And then on the, we'll take use the same trousers for, because we're under you know the time constraints. We're going to use this as a smoking vest, and, or sorry, this will be the coat with with the vest. this. The vest will have that, which is kind of boom. And then the inside will have 
polka dot, black on black polka dot. Lastly is, oh, this. We're gonna get this going because I'm sure there'll be something I have to go to, but I wanna do the black seer sucker in due tone. So there's basically three outfits going and then we're gonna get ready for Aquaman. Do you want the peak over the notch? That's a notch. I like those peaks. Peaks fine. I like the I agree. flares. Peak. Yeah. Do we? Right. Yep. Roll that. Awesome. Awesome. Pleasure. Yee really excited. All right. You guys are my first. Here we go, my love. You're all set. We're at Henry Pool, one of the most famous tailors in the world. Used to run this whole street, and I'm getting my second fitting for, uh, actually we're gonna do my Bond suit. I never thought I'd be able to go to James Bond, but he actually did Daniel Craig's too, so it's pretty cool. Look who I did last time, there you go, buddy. <laughs> yeah, good to see you oh, too. Wait. Welcome, welcome, this is Simon Cundy. Hey, Daniel, this is my friend Chris Sharma. How are you doing? Nice to meet you, very nice to meet you. Michael Jordan Climbing. That's how I like to describe it. <laughs> This is Simon Candy, all right? Oh, <laughs> yeah, <it's wonderful. laughs> I know. It's exciting, buddy. Really. Very it's much so now. Right? It's pretty exciting. Pleasure. Pleasure. I was telling him that I've been coming here since I was, must be about 21, 22, and always dreamed. And, and I always looked at your windows, and you're my favorite windows. And I, one day I was like, I want this, Good this, this, and this. And so um, to be able to, and, you, and I, every time I came in, you guys were always closed because it would always be like a Sunday when I come in or something like that. But. Oh, it was amazing. I got the tour. Yeah. And it's okay. just all the history and learning about the whole street. So well, you come to the real authentic, you know, the home of tailoring here in Savile Row. Absolutely. The real deal when it comes down to the founders of the Savile Row. That's yeah. where it started from. And other great customers like, you know, Edward VII and Churchill and, you know, so many of these customers that invented things that, yeah. like the dinner suit, for example, yeah. that's what we do. So it was all amongst the Europeans. Kaiser Wilhelm, Edward VII. So wow. Turned together. So in diplomatic times, turn of the century, you would have turned up with different regalia representing your country. You would have to the front country. Yeah. This is you, Ben Paper 4. There you go. So, you too could have me. <laughs> <laughs> it's that easy. So, you know, you've got your, effectively, your whole full part. Oh. Is, uh, <laughs> this is the part on our show every time they're like, all right, well, it's your turn to try it. I'm like, this, yeah. I get massive anxiety. So, uh, yeah. big shoes for a big guy. Oh, well, sure, sure. so That's what happens. Do we have any? Oh, that sounds so good. Oh. <laughs> Talk shit too early. <laughs> well, look at that. That's my new one. I spelled my name wrong though. Are you it's M A M O I. I was fucking. <laughs> <laughs> it's Sir Jason Momoa, Pride of Gypsies. Gypsy. Can you believe it? No, no, it's perfect, bro. It's right. Everything is. <laughs> Everything's right. Just I'm just playing with you. <laughs> Thank you.
Move it, on it. Yeah. <laughs> favorite color in the world. It's tough between this and light pink. Turn me into a changed man, Mr. Henry Poole. Here we are, the dune. The dune for me. So we spoke about, you know, dune look, which looks incredible. I've got it. Um, we were going to do the frog around the pockets, and but you kept saying about embroidery, embroidery, embroidery. Yeah. Okay, and I thought we couldn't do it for a time, and. Cost and logistics. <laughs> what is cost? What is logistics? So, what are other things? So Big words. Our friend across the road, who it's actually her last day today because she is on maternity leave and she is ready to give birth, has <laughs> stayed across the road to come and show you something. So oh, you know, shit. All right, we're doing it. Thank you. So, Congratulations. Thank you very much. As, uh, no. polka dots. So, <laughs> as explained, Claire has very, very kindly held Wow! Look at that. Right. So we heard that you quite liked the, the beautiful embroidered cuffs. I do. I love it. Really cool. I don't know how much you know already. Um, I know nothing. I absolutely I know nothing. Okay. Well, we're going to remember making you some. Really? Yes. Nice to you. Me too. I'm not on pink crushed velvet, but these are the ones that are going on your jacket. That's beautiful. Pleasure to meet you too. Wow. Oh. Yeah, it does make it a little bit, a little bit quicker on the machine, but there's still got a lot of um, work that they do with those stuff as well. So you can find it. Wow. Congratulations. Also, Claire's last day. Yeah. Yeah. Good. <laughs> I've always wanted to do this. There we go. I'm sure that's good. King Edward VIII. King of Atlantis. The there it is, man. We did it. Love you. What's up, Mama? Nothing.